It is so quiet out here. Beautiful, beautiful Monday. Perfect weather. There's nobody out here. So, this trail is <clears throat> pretty new. I guess they added to it. And this is only 25 minutes from the house. It's a lake. Um, and I think it's called the Wulo Hollow Lake. They have campsites. Let me see if I can show you. Can really tell, but there's campsites for RV hookups all over there. Um, nice lake. You can rent like uh, kayaks and whatever. Um, kayaks and what's the other one? The ones that you kind of pedal. I forgot what those are called. But here's the uh, bike trail. You guys want to freeze that and read that? So, I parked right here, and I guess you uh, take this fire road down here, and you can connect all the trails. And there's a lot of trails. Like, this is a huge trail here. See, so, you can do trail length, which is this, this one here. It's 9.2 miles. And then you have a north loop and a south loop. So, uh, where's the compass? So that's the north loop and that's the south loop. I had an opportunity to move for work. I work for the railroad. You can't just go wherever. You have to like find somebody to swap seniority with. And I've been with the railroad for like 17 years. So it was hard to find somebody that was wanting to move to Arizona. But he had family there. And he asked if I would swap seniority with him. I'm like... <laughs> you don't have to ask me twice. I just, it still amazes me. You know, I when I came from Ukraine to, um, to Arizona, me and my dad um, have huge asthma problems. Well, had, I guess. Um, well, my dad, he, <clears throat> he passed years back. But um, uh, I don't really use my inhaler much since I moved to the Arizona, or should I say to the U.S., Sometimes I still have to use it, but uh, not much. So that's why we moved to Arizona is because of the dry humidity and the dry air. It's good for people with asthma. Um, but just coming here to this wonderful state of Arkansas, just the, the trees and the greenery and um, just all the plantation is just so nice. It just amazes me every day. Um, I, I'm never going to leave Arkansas. I'm never going to move Ar out of Arkansas. I'm probably going to retire here. Like, I don't know if you guys know, but Arkansas is like the the capital of of <laughs> of, of uh, the U.S. for bikers. There's so many trails and and uh, state parks here. It just amazes me every day. Um, there's just continuous amount of trails you can you can go check out and explore. So I love it. Just look how clean this is <clears throat> over here. Look at that. There's no trash. You know, there's trash cans right there. So people. Are are taking care of the trails um here's one trail you start in right here there's a a, a bike work stand that is cool you know you got tools <laughs> you have some kind of pick you got a air pump all the wrenches you got like a little holder for your bike a hanger should i say so yeah there's my truck I just, I just noticed, but my truck matches my bike. Kind of like the gray color. Look at that. I just cleaned her up yesterday. I clean my bike after every ride. But I'm still digging these uh, tan wall tires. Just really, really nice. And like I said before, guys, in my last video, um, these Industry 9 tires or tires, rims are amazing. Well, the tires are amazing too. These are the Maxxes. Uh, but the, the rims... They do such an improvement on, on the ride experience. Um, it just amazes me. These are the Industry 9 305s, if you guys are wondering. <clears throat> and they are rated for, for e-bikes. So you, you can get these for e-bikes. I'm going to quit talking and uh, get to riding. Maybe I'll stop and take a quick shot for you guys. Show you where I'm at. You guys stay safe out there. Well, I stopped for a water break. Believe it or not, guys, it's, it's not that hot right now, but it's humid. I'm still getting used to the humidity here in Arkansas. 
Arizona is just dry heat. So you don't feel the humidity. I keep hearing like strange sounds. Like somebody's following me. You hear that? It's like a, a cow. Or a chupacabra or something. I thought there's no bears over here. You hear that? I'm not joking. What the hell is that? Oh man, I'm like in the middle of nowhere by myself. <laughs> oh boy. This is. Did you ever put. Just, you guys hear that? Here's a trail. I just, I love this. You can't see anything and everything looks the same. So I'm recording this. First time out here, so I can actually pause it and review the video and see where I started at because I don't know where the hell I am. And there's not really signs anywhere here. He's kind of going to follow the trail. This is the south, south loop at Woolo Hollow. Oh, I love it here. It's so peaceful and calming. Like this, this is my zen, guys. I come out here to de-stress and just clear my mind, relax, get some exercise. It's just so beautiful. You hear that? Anyways, I'm gonna I'm gonna get going before I get eaten by something. Catch you guys later.